what can we do with racking? And then we'll go into some education about the different styles and different possibilities of racking, traditional versus modern, what's efficient, and then, you know, mixing that in with their style. And then we start playing around with some designs. We usually do some drafts to see where we're at, see if we're capturing the vision that the client has. And that is actually kind of the easiest one. Then we just, once we know their style and we know what we got to work with, we just start drawing and racking. And so we spend a good amount of time trying to figure out the style. What is the goal? How many bottles? We kind of educate at the same time as we're trying to get educated from them on what they're looking for. The racking is built to fill the space corner to corner. So we need those final dimensions of what those corner to corner spaces are before we order that racking. And it's also very economical. It's a way to make a great looking seller on a budget, especially if you've, if you've made a cooled space, you've already spent a lot of money on creating that cooled space because it's basically just an igloo cooler and the cooling unit. And the vintage view is a great way to not spend too much on the racking, but have a really pleasing racking. And it's just very functional. It's just really easy to access. It's displays the wine really nicely. It's very popular. It really helps clients that are working on a budget. We've done some where they do have some racking in them it's not really important anymore when you're just trying to store wine and you need access to it a lot of restaurants will have a display cellar which is smaller usually you know mostly for marketing purposes and then in the back they'll have another just storage cellar where it's just wine stacked up floor to ceiling in a cooled space so it's ready for service they can access it and get it and it's already cooled ready for service so what becomes important then is being able to display the bottles in a easy way to see them, easy way to select. So we tend to go with a lot of racking that has display views. So the wine is visible. It's not just, you know, bottle cork out type displays. For example, the round, the round ones, the bottle is displayed on top. So you know what's below it, then you just store it below it. So it makes it easy to access. And these are very popular. We always, we do these round, we do them you know, square and rectangular with the display row at the top and then bulk storage kind of underneath of what, you know, what's being sold. And then on the, the larger bins, what we did is we put these little displays out in front so you could see what is in those bulk storages. 